Main Street in Buffalo is a pretty busy place most days, especially most weekdays. And so when this massive fire broke out and smoke began to fill the sky over the city, there were many people around to witness it all unfold. And for that side of the story, we want to turn now to our Keelan Berrien. Hi, Keelan. Good evening, Kate. Well, before we talk about some of the witnesses I'll talk to today, I'm going to step out of the way here to show you. Now, we heard earlier that Mayor Byron Brown was issuing that emergency demolition. It looks like Ziff is going underway right now. We're standing in the parking lot of Eastman Machine Company that stands, that sits right behind the demolition here. And, you know, we was talking to a couple, a, a couple witnesses, and majority of them was really worried about the condition of the firefighter. Now, we are aware that this building is DC Theatrics. However, majority of witnesses at the scene aren't too familiar with the building. They say most of the time they're walking near it, it appears to be closed. But today, a few witnesses that was at the scene when the fire first started say the building only appeared to be smoky and took a while for the flames to appear. But once those flames did break through, bystanders say it made a big boom sound. In fact, some say they had to take a few steps back because of how far the flames came out of the building. Jason Colson is one of the first witnesses at the scene, and here's what he had to say. For a few seconds, it was just smoke, about maybe 30 seconds to a minute. It was just a lot of smoke coming out, and then all of a sudden, there was a burst of flames, and um, and you could hear the floor fall. There was a sound like of the of the fire sort of bursting out of the window, and then you could hear the uh, out of the front windows there, and then you could hear the floor fall. Yeah. Well, I was on my way home, actually, driving down Main Street. I live on Edwards Street, and I could see all the flames. And as I approached my street, it was blocked off, so I had to turn off early. I saw all the flames and the black smoke got home, took a walk over to see what was going on. So yes, this fire has been going on since a little after 10 this morning. We're back live out here again. Once again, you're looking at the demolition of the DC Theatrics building. It just literally started minutes away from here. The building was severely burned. Earlier, a floor inside the structure actually collapsed. But later on today, we hear from one of our witnesses who had her son fighting this fire. And you can see and hear the concerns that she had to say. But reported in Buffalo, Keelan Berry, Channel 2 News.